let me just uh, give you an overview of the ecosystem. Paano ba tumatakbo ang isang stock market? So it all starts with companies, di ba? Like, like uh, what the video said earlier. So companies, when they need capital for business, they raise that capital. Ano? So maraming sources of uh, capital. So pwedeng either kunin nila yan through loan, mangutang sila sa mga banks, or mag-issue sila ng mga corporate bonds, yan, mga, mga securities of indebtedness, or they raise their capital through equities, no? through private equity investors. Now, if they raise the capital through equity in a, in a big stage, no? in a public scale, they do that through the PSE and, and they do that through listing. So they list their company, they list their shares in the Philippine Stock Exchange, they sell the shares, they distribute the shares to the public in exchange for capital. So investors buy shares from the company, so they invest na sila dun sa company. Na yon. They become part owners of that company. Now, these companies that uh, conduct uh, their equity uh, share offering or equity fundraising for the first time are conducting what we call an IPO or initial public offering. So, yan. Pag nakakarinig kayo ng IPO, so these are basically companies na nag-delist sa PSE for the first time. So, investors can participate in IPOs, even retail investors open po sa inyo. Yan. Now, after the offer period, the shares are listed and then actively traded in the stock market. So investors who were able to buy, no, nakabili during the IPO, kung tumaas na yung presyo, di pwede na magbenta, kumita na sila. Or if they want to invest more, they can buy more. Now for those investors naman na hindi po nakabili during the IPO, okay lang. Because they can buy in the secondary market. So yung secondary market naman, ito yung tinatawag nating stock market na. So in the stock market, the shares that being bought, that are being bought and sold, no, yung nabibili at nabibentang shares dito, so between investors na yan. So nagbabuy and sell na fellow investors. So kung titignan mo, dito ang ikot ng trading. So buying investor, selling investor, buy and sell, um, palit ng shares. So naiintindi na, na natin ang trading. So what happens naman after trading? So say for example, bumili ako ng shares or nagbenta ako ng shares. Kailan ko ba makukuha yung pera ko? So yung clearing and settlement process natin happens in 3 days or tinatawag nating T plus 3. Okay, so yung, um, we have our central clearing house or the SECP. So they serve as the intermediary in making the delivery upon payment of securities. So the SECP ensures that, that there is no default in the transaction. So basically, the buying broker delivers the cash and the selling broker delivers the shares. Okay, so yung shares, nasaan naman yung shares natin? So all the shares here are electronic, no? Uh, they are what we call scriptless. So the scriptless shares uh, allows us to trade actively uh, during trading hours. So kaya liquid ang mga investments natin, kaya mabilis siyang gumalaw dahil electronic siya. And um, they are safely stored in the Philippine uh, Depository, so the ating PDTC. So the PDTC acts as the custodian for scriptless securities. So you can see here, guys, in the slide, the entire stock market ecosystem.